You don't have to be in Northwest Georgia to see it. Really, you can see it anywhere around the metro Atlanta area. Our Grace King is atop Stone Mountain right now. And Grace, as folks are viewing this eclipse, eye protection is the very important part of this, right? It is, and they're actually handing out those solar eclipse glasses on top of Stone Mountain here where we're getting ready for a partial eclipse viewing party. The crowds have been building all day and park leaders expect a lot of people, but whether you're here or elsewhere, the most important thing is to protect your eyes. So if you have those glasses or someone's handing them out, that's great. You want to make sure they're in good condition and not counterfeit. What you want to watch out for is glasses that might be crumpled up, scratched or bent like these ones. Experts say that can let enough light through that they'll damage your eyes. Now, if you don't have eclipse glasses, that's OK, too. Emory University physics professor Aaron Mills Bonning says there are other ways to experience it safely. Where sunlight passes through leaves of trees and dapples on the ground, the small spaces between the leaves make little tiny pinhole projectors, and you can see dozens of images of the partial eclipse in the dappled light on the ground. And when we talk about those things to look out for with your solar eclipse glasses, you want it to have this mirrory look on the front and for it to be solid black on the back. You also want to have this little ISO certification label as well as the manufacturer name and location to make sure that they're not counterfeit. But again, wherever you are, just be safe. Don't look directly at the sun unless you have those glasses and have fun like we're ready to do here on top of Stone Mountain. Chris, I'll send it back to you.